I'm Mike from Music Radio Creative. In this video, I'll show you how to edit on the fly and also return to the start of your multi-track session. Okay, this is often something when you're editing podcasts or a long session of jingles, uh, you want to make little edits uh, as you're going along and playing the audio back. For instance, like this. Your feel-good music, brought to you by MapLink Travel Advisor. Follow us on Facebook.com. Your feel Oh, and I wanted to edit there, but keep listening to the rest of the session. And as I selected the point, I wanted to hit the delete key and edit that bit out. It just kept playing uh, back the audio that I'd already listened to, which is not super handy. This can happen if you have loop mode enabled. This is what will make this happen. So if you've been looping for whatever reason uh, to listen to a piece of audio over and over, detect some sibilance and get it analyzed in frequency analysis, make sure this is disabled and then you can do your edits on the fly. Have a listen. Your feel good music brought to you by MapLink Travel Advisor. Follow us on Facebook.com slash MapLink. You're relaxing. And as you could see there, I was playing the session back. The playhead continued while I selected a portion of audio, hit the delete key, all in real time. That is what you want. So loop mode off to get that. Another question I've recently been submitted a few times, um, particularly by users who also use Logic, uh, like myself for MIDI stuff, um, they're very used to playing a session and then they want to listen to it all from the beginning again and they're used to hitting the return key uh, or the enter key and then the playhead jumps to the beginning and you can listen from the start. And a lot of you have been asking, Mike, how do you do this? Uh, well, it's pretty simple. Um, if you've got the home key on your keyboard, just hit home. But unfortunately, for a Mac user like myself with a very tiny keyboard like that, there is no home key on it. So where is this setting located and how can we remap it? Go into the edit menu, look for keyboard shortcuts, and then down here in the search for different commands, you just type in beginning, and then you'll see here under transport, move playhead to beginning, assign to home. I'm just gonna unassign that, hitting the cross, click in here. Now, if I hit return or enter now, it just exits from the dialog box, which is not the desired behavior. Oh, uh, keyboard shortcuts again. Uh, let's go for beginning. Oh, there it is. <laughs> and uh, so the way we can map this uh, pesky little return key, which will just click OK instead of assigning the key. You just literally click the return key up here. You drag it and you drop it onto the shortcut here. And then move play here to beginning is now mapped to return. And now you have a kind of logic pro feature inside audition I can play you're relaxing but i want to go back to the beginning return oh yeah i'm at the beginning of my session so no matter where i go in the track now return 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 brilliant love it this is something i definitely recommend setting up uh, because it's nice when you're editing a big long session sometimes you just want to go straight back to the start and play it from the beginning uh, let me know if you're going to be mapping that key yourself and if you need any adobe audition help happy to help as much as i can in the comments down below oh.